Hey guys, welcome back to Yelena app. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you how to fix up to monitor black screen or no signal. So if you're interested, let's start the tutorial. Now, if you're having problems with your scepter monitor here and you're getting a black screen or no signal notification, well, in this case, there are a few things that you could do here to probably solve this issue. Now, just to give you an example here, I have a bunch of photos for a scepter monitor. So the first thing that you want to do or guarantee here is you want to make sure that you have those monitor and your PC probably plugged in. Now, sometimes a loose connection here can cause this problem. So in this case, uh, most likely it is the cause itself. So in this case, you want to go and visit your HDMI if you're using HDMI here. And you want to make sure that the HDMI on your PC is properly plugged in. And same thing on your monitor here. So check the back here and see if it's properly plugged in. So you want to make sure it's all the way in, make sure it's not loose and it's uh, fully plugged in. Now, in this case, once you've done that, see if that solves the issue. Now, another thing that you could do here to solve this issue is to uh, basically uh, try different uh, options. Like, for example, if you have in another HDMI cord in your house, you might want to use that instead because sometimes the HDMI cord itself is the problem. Now, if that doesn't work, you might want to connect your PC to a different monitor if you have an extra one at home and see if the problem itself is not the PC. Now, if the problem itself is your PC, then it means that you won't be able to use your monitor here. So there are going to be other problems you need to address in order for you to use that. So you can also try your scepter monitor here on a different device if you have one, like a laptop. You can go and connect that and see if that actually plays the uh, screen on your monitor. Now, if none of those work, like for example, it, your PC is working, but monitor uh, uh, wise is not working, there's a few things I would recommend you try doing here. So another thing that you can try here is to use the other ports that is currently available on your Scepter monitor. Sometimes the actual port here or the HDMI port, if you're using that, which is the most popular one here. So if you're using the HDMI here, sometimes there might be some problems on the actual port. So you might want to use the display port here or the DVI. Now the easiest way here is the display port because you can get this literally anywhere. So uh, it's uh, the next version after HDMI here with the newer one, newer, newer one here. So you might want to get uh, use your display port here and also connect it on a display port. But if you don't have a display port on your monitor or on your PC, might you might need to get a adapter for that one that converts your HDMI into a display port. But if you have a specialized uh, type of um, like cord that uh, connects a display port directly into HDMI. Better if you have those, go ahead and use that. But if you don't have a display port here and you want to use the DVI, you need to use a specialized cord for this one or a uh, converter, if you will. So that uh, you, I actually, I actually bought uh, a different one. Like I used my DVI previously. And I actually converted this into an HDMI, which is awesome because uh, I, I want to use the other options available right now. But yeah, so again, you could go and use other ports here to try and see if that solves the issue. Now, if none of those work, another thing that you could try here is to check the insides of your PC. Now, sometimes if you're moving around your PC, some of the components can move around. So what you need to do is you want to make sure that your RAM is properly plugged in. So this is just an example. This is what a uh, usual motherboard usually look like. So this is these slots for the RAM. So you might want you might want to go ahead and push your RAMs in here. Sometimes if they come a bit of, a bit loose here, it can affect the visuals or the uh, output of your uh, actual PC. So it means uh, you need to go ahead and use a little bit of force here, just a little bit. Don't push it uh, too hard. So yeah, so make sure it's properly plugged in and see if that works. Now, if none of the methods here work, so the problem itself might be your PC if uh, the monitor works on other devices, but if your PC works on other monitors, then most likely the problem itself is going to be your monitor or your scepter monitor here. So you might want to get a warranty or check your warranty in this one or even uh, consult with a technician in order for you to solve this problem. But in this case, that's about it. Hopefully this video was able to help you. Like and subscribe and see you line up. Thank you for watching.